NASA has lost all communications with their brand new capstone spacecraft. Is this mission recoverable? Who does this impact and why? And the biggest question of all, why did they lose communications? Let's dive into it. Capstone stands for Cislunar Autonomous Positioning System Technology Operations and Navigation Experiment. Capstone is a lunar orbiter that is to test the orbital stability for the upcoming Lunar Gateway space station, which will be used to return humans to the moon. The CubeSat will also test a navigation system which will measure, measure Capstone's position relative to the, to the LRO, or Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter. That means that the mission will not rely on ground stations. The spacecraft costs around 13.7 million US dollars, and the contract was awarded to the private, to the private company called Advanced Space. Advanced Space is located in Boulder, Colorado. The mission was originally intended to launch from NASA's Wallops Flight Facility, but was later moved from the Mahia Peninsula in New Zealand. The spacecraft launched aboard an electron rocket from Launch Complex 1B. However, on June 28, 2022, Electron lift, lifted off into the night sky. The first and second stage of Electron performed nominally prior to separating the photon kick stage. The hypercuriation on the photon kick stage ignited six times to circularize the orbit around Earth, and the seventh burn was the translunar injection burn. The capsule spacecraft was then separated on July 4, 2022. On July 5, 2022, NASA reported that they had lost contact with the spacecraft shortly after separation from the photon kick stage. So what does that mean? Well, that is what I will get into very soon. Not much is currently known about why they lost communications, but it is confirmed that NASA did lose communications with the spacecraft. They said that they were currently working on trying to get them back. It has almost been 12 hours at the time of writing this video, and they have still not regained communications with the capstone spacecraft. There is a slight chance that this mission is recoverable. They could possibly fix communications to send directly to Earth, but, that, but they would be weak. They could also just fix the issue and could send the data to the LRO or Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter. Or they could send the mission over to Photon, which could complete some of the goals which were intended for the capstone mission to complete. But of course, they would not achieve all of their goals, but they would complete more if they just didn't do anything. So it is a pretty tough time for the people that are working on the spacecraft, but let's hope that they can regain communications with Capstone before it is too late. The loss of communications is for sure not Rocket Lab's fault, as the LOS, or loss of signal, occurred after they separated from the photon upper stage. So Rocket Lab is in the clear. However, it could also be the LRO's fault. However, it is most likely not, because it has been in orbit for over 10 years as being placed there in 2009. So it is most likely the Capstone team the spacecraft was built by Terran Orbital, however it is controlled by Advanced Space. So the failure most likely affects them the most. Good luck Terran Orbital and Advanced Space, let's hope that they can re-establish the communications with the spacecraft, because this is Advanced Space's first mission, so let's hope they do not lose the mission. That's it for this video, set to see the capstone mission lose communications, but failures can teach us things that we wouldn't know if it, they had succeeded. But let's hope that they can regain signal with capstone, and I will keep you guys updated on my channel and on my website. But for this video, that is it, and good luck, Capstone.